Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to a Saturday creative stream. Uh, as you're aware, just after Boxing Day, we did the first stage of the Sunny White Man Skateboard uh, by applying the crystal clear resin. Now we're on to the next stage. This time, putting the whole lot together. So sit back and uh, enjoy. Right, without further ado, Sunny White Man Skateboard. We've got to countersink the bolts. So we've got a countersink bit on the drill. Now this has been this has been this has been charged uh, last night. So fingers crossed. Hope it's not going to the back in the bag. So we're going to basically rip the bolts. You already know the two test bits one uh, last night. Well, yesterday, uh, yesterday morning, just to make sure that this is fit. And after we took the uh, all the masking tape off the uh, resin, after we after the resin was cured, which is 48 hours uh, before New Year, uh, we had to re-drill the holes because they're full of uh, uh, resin, even though we had actually masked it over this side before we applied it. upgraded all the infrastructure in the house by making new disk uh, Wi-Fi thing. So, you know, we're picking that up and, and believe you me, there are very, believe you me, it looks like promising. Now at the moment we've got three webcams. We've got uh, an old Kodo Shark Super, which has got a light on it. This is like the one facing me, facing me at the moment, not facing the head. The other one, we've got the small HD webcam, which is here. And then we've got one uh, up here on a, on a tripod. So, you know, we're perfectly good. Uh, I've got to make sure these fit. This really should be really recessed now. Perfect. Might have to actually fold that a bit. Right, so let's do the other one. That's four of them.
we've got a we've got our round file. Make sure these Just to basically get through the sign of the, uh, the vegetable veg juice, basically collected in it. It's like a, it's a drill bit, has it? Sort of uh, drilled it all out. Do have a spare bolt and it's not the right colour, it looks shit. It's all, all 
all of this is colour coordinated. to be a little bit more deeper number, uh, number four What I want is recess straight in so it's flush with the uh, deck. It's just that uh, when you put the grip tape in, you see, guys. Right? Right, let's put that one in. That one's in okay. There's a little bit more of this work in here. I've only been doing this for since about a couple of years, two years now, but it's about five, my, my fifth skateboard I've actually built. Custom job. And it's been like, uh, it's been like, uh, one World of Warcraft one. Uh, one football themed one and uh, two Overwatch style ones.
that's going to do, it's going to be, so it's going to, going to be like a grip tape on it, so that's okay, so, so then, not okay, so that's uh, done, a little bit off centre on that, I can't do that, I think I might need, I mean to be honest, I might need a new bit, new counting bit, Really true, I can do really get the new drill. This one's okay, but it needs to be a bit more detailed. So let's just double check where we are. So that one is, these ones have got to be readjusted. So there's a little bit more. So those of you who joined us, we are making a, we are putting together a Sally Mike main skateboard. Uh, this is part two of it. Before, after Boxing Day, uh, we put all that, we actually applied the clear crystal resin. Left that for 48 hours. And then because of the Christmas break, the only thing we, would be, we could not, we had everything else, but the only thing we couldn't, uh, could continue with it with it because we're waiting for one item and that arrived uh, just after the new year. And that was a that was a red grip case which we got. So we, so today it's like putting it all together. I want to make sure this is this is uh, perfect. And we will have in the future a live stream of, uh, of when we start the Sylvana skateboard, the Death Whisper.
Oh my god. I'm missing a bolt. I think I'm missing a bolt somewhere.
Gotcha. Let me slide that one down. That one needs to be a little bit. Needs to be. Yeah. <laughs> 
Right, would you believe it, guys? I was just drinking my coffee, and it was in the coffee. Coffee. I thought, hang on, what's that clicking? And it was like, there. Thank God for that. We've got all of them. <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, another blue on clip. Right. We've done the, uh, we've got the next stage, and this is like the uh, tricky bit. This is like one chance only to get this right. And grip tape can be a pain in the butt to uh, put down. So we've got. Something's about to my camera. Something's about to my camera. That's better. Rose up. So we've got here, we've got very nice red grip tape. Now this a trick of this to do this is first of all get our white spirit. So you get white spirit and we get Now what we've done is, because this was all uh, had all masking tape around these edges, uh, we had to do a lot of sanding down to get rid of the residue that didn't and got under the masking tape when we collected the drip. So we've done it, we spent yesterday cleaning this all up. So leave that to evaporate, and then we've got a clean surface. Go right on that edge there. We've got a little bit of uh, vegetarian, so it's basically virtually even. So 
And she literally clamped that to that. And she makes me sure it's Stephen Stevens. And what we're going to do, we're going to take the backing off. Now, this stuff, if it's in cold weather, it can actually, it actually can literally deteriorate to really sort of go up to make it not stick. Now, if you do, do need to do this, then it's right on the edge. If you really want to do this properly, do it in a warm, warm, in a warm environment. It's basically like the, uh, the Aziz won't go off. If we need to actually stick it down properly, we'll make you use and put some uh, contact adhesive on it. And then, then just peel it back. This goes back to my experience of actually putting uh, uh, company, company stickers onto uh, pickup trucks. You know, when I, was, when I was in the building industry, you know, basically we logo everything. We had the magnets and had everything. And then, of course, what happened was we were back in, all our bands had had like the back in the bid for like London 2012. We've got to give it, send the stickers over to uh, our fleet department. And then I got, I got the, uh, the boys job of actually re get the stickers all put on like transit bands in a pickup truck. And it was quite, it took me all, 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 all one half a day to do that. So we've got a little bit left over there. Now we're going to literally flatten that down. We've got a little bit edge there we're going to have to kill it. Not so calm. We can we can move it. This is not stuck down fully. But I'm not going to because the thing is I don't want to try not to have any creases in it. So that's flush there, so we have to cut around here and it's basically a lot of trimming and all that to be done next and filing down so we get like a, a clean straight edge. Uh, I'll show you an example guys. What we've done on here, exactly what we're trying to get done for here, for, for this one. We've got a nice, little, least clean edge to go around there. The uh, scissors. Excuse me a moment. Also, a uh, if I can find it, uh, an artist scalpel, and if I can find that as well. My box knife. So we're going to try and get as close as to the edge as possible. This is like the sort of 
you know, take the time to get this at least 100% perfect. It's like almost like a one chant. Pick this up just in case it faces. I don't want to rip any of it, let me see. down straight edge I quite enjoy doing these staples Tidy edge, and I can actually start adjusting it. This did come out right, I would have had to abandon the stream and start on from you. <laughs>
so this is going to be uh, not rushed on this because we want to get this nice neat. Now what you could do is start off with like big chunks of the uh, quick tape with a pair of scissors and start and start scaling down with like a box knife and then one of these after scars. I don't want to start thinking using the scissors again just in case I take too much off and got too much of like the depth exposed. And you really want a really nice tidy job here. So you're going to have to bear with me to get all this uh, rip tape off. You see we're all basically on the uh, sort of like the last hurdle to be exact. You know, it does you have to make tidy up the uh, uh the bolt the counter sinks and luckily i found that one it's like sort of like dropped in my coffee cup <laughs> No, it's not, it's, it doesn't look a bit tatty at the moment, but once we get some of this, uh, once we get this plus to this line here, hopefully, fingers crossed, this will look perfect. Oh, 
Yeah. So we've got neighbours that make a game with the kids. We're going to have to put a sign up saying do not disturb live streaming in progress. Right, so that's nearly done. You can see there, we've got a little bit tiny. It's tiny enough there. Let's get it in there, guys. I don't want to sort of start finding bits off. Uh, I'll to try and get this like even Stevens. doing now is we try and get this like a sort of a rough sort of rest but where they are the bevel it gave me like flash you just basically tilt the scarpel about 45 degrees and then hopefully So, so far, so good. We've just got a little bit around this little edge here, guys. I don't know what's better, whether it's live streaming the, the game or it's live streaming like the creative thing. But best of both worlds, I'll say. It's enjoyable. So, if you have a look at it now, we've got a, a main uh, sort of most of it off now. There's a little bit there, I might be able to get off with the knife, but I don't want to make it too much. I said to uh, Asriel, I'll make you a Sally White main skateboard. So basically, like, we're putting it off for a long, long time. So, right over Christmas time, I'm getting this finished. So, we're ready for her before MCN. Thank 
Right, so that's that done, most of it, like a sort of a rough uh, sort of trimming. You can't brush this with tape business. You know, as I said, it's like a one chance to do it right. You know, because otherwise what they can do all of the tape. Mind you, the colour tape is more expensive than like an all black tape. That really surprised me. I'm just going to hit the shop here. So what we need is a where is it? Right, back in a minute, guys. I'm going to get a cup of coffee. It's freezing in here. <laughs>
Right, so we're going to ch uh, change the uh, stepping around now. We've got to mount the bolts now, guys. So we throw, cut out the hole, we, we pinpointed where the bolts are going to go in the grip tape. We get some bolts, bolts, bolts off. All this sort of uh, untidy here is going to be hidden. Only way I could do it without the bolts dropping out. Right, so we've got that secure now. What I'm going to do, I'm going to move this camera back up onto that desk, take this table out. I don't know how to unfold it.
Right. Suck time. Here we are. Some nice gold. Thing suck. Now we get this. We keep it with these things here. Cut the face. Inwards to each other. Now this is going to be uh, quite a challenge. <laughs> so we've got one Allen key. And I've got to find uh, the perfect size spanner. Just was too big. So what I'm going to do? We're going to hang two of the bolts top first, so it's like it hangs it on, and so it doesn't fall off. Now let's just make a double check with the. So we just tell me that the uh, the thing is, I haven't actually done that on uh, my Death light staple because the uh, <laughs> one stuck inside the wrong way, it's facing that way. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you've you got your trucks mm -hmm. and they go positioned like that inwards. So these bushes are inwards. <laughs> So you've got one uh, Allen key. Now, I wonder if I could use my ratchet. So we're going to have each of the bolts, we're going to have finger tight, so you have to like, just put them on loosely, but you're not going to like pull them tightly. Oh, 
Jay Mark actually tried to show this, uh, you know, close up with all these red cans around. But actually had to move the different seconds, different seconds around. Perfect. Right, so there's basically the figures, figures, figures type of on. So each one you have to basically. So that goes on there. Alan Key. Just basically try this each one in turn. The only way I'll do it is to like, put it on the one that you can do the So when we tighten each one, it's actually getting, actually moving the truck closer to the tight to actually be secured to like the front, the other side of the ball. Oh, 